But it is such a joy for me to sit across from you here today. When we spoke in Tampa last year, yeah. you told me that you, you went through a really tough health scare. You said you nearly died. You know what's great? If you almost die, you get so much attention. It feels so nice that, to be that loved. I, listen, so I plan on another one. No, I'm kidding. I, I, love, that, <laughs> I love that you're making jokes. I love that no, that's what your brain is No, it crazy at. serious. And yeah, to be yeah. here today, thriving. How are you doing? It's great. The attention you get from almost dying is incredible. I mean, it's... <laughs> It's because we love you so I mean, much. I want to say everyone should try it, but they really should. No, please avoid no, yeah. that. No, it's crazy. Like, mm -hmm. it's it's wild how life is. Like, you know, uh, yeah, I mean, it was just this crazy abscess that was on my throat. But yeah. next thing you know. You went to like, the Barbie like, premiere. Yeah. And then, and then <laughs> boom, I was in the hospital. I had to, like, be evac off a mountain to have an emergency surgery. And, uh, and I woke up and was like, you know. It's like, like you were there and you were there. No, I'm kidding, but it was uh, it's like the Wizard of you know Oz, but in a weird, I was like, what happened? Mm. But it's great. You're because, doing well today? Yeah, like it, it wasn't an organ or anything. It was just something that had to be you know cut out. I've only got one, um, one tonsil now, which is so much nicer than just one uvula, if you know what that 1, is. One thousand percent, yeah. yes. But uh, any kind of dangling <laughs> meats or flesh in the back of your throat, you know, do you really need it? So it's up for debate. Yeah, it's up for debate. Yes. Okay. So life is <laughs> life is good. He's cracking himself up. <laughs> Meanwhile, we're preparing for our holiday meals. Don't worry about that dangling <laughs> chunk of meat. It's just part of the recipe. <laughs> I'm happy to see you here today. You just celebrated a milestone 60th, 60th, I Thank should say, you. 60th, 60th yes. birthday. Yeah. How do you feel achieving this new milestone? It's great. At the end of the day, I can finally let my skin relax, you know, and it finally the the sags and the weight uh, from just keeping it up all day has been. Uh... You're aging backwards. <laughs> Come on. We saw that thirst trap on Instagram. Oh, oh yes. Like whenever I can that? thirst trap, yes. Um, and I do it mainly for my friends who are 10 years younger than me and still hate me to this day because of it. Um, but no, what, I, they're, I don't they're know hating what it is. on, a, on a man who's in shape and can post a, a thirst <laughs> trap at 60. I don't know. From the, my generation, we never took care of ourselves. So this is a this is a miracle you're looking at. Uh, actually, Rob Lowe is a miracle. If you ever get up close, you're like, oh, yeah. how is that possible? You you're on I mean? you're on the Rob Lowe level. I'm well, I'm telling you on right his now. diet. So that's uh, no, I'm kidding. Oh, but, I was uh, like, no, I eat everything, including garbage, and it's one of my favorites. <laughs> I'm just like my dogs. I'm a garbaholic, and I. I love it, especially chips. I can't get enough. <laughs> so no real secrets to, oh, no, to trap no, in so much thirst no, like that. Nope. In fact, I barely wash my face. But that's a that's a story for a different time. <laughs>